What's up guys, Shane Starts here with Droid Moderx, and after just a couple of days of using the Galaxy Note 9, there is one thing that really bugs me about the Galaxy Note 9, and that is the Bixby button. There's actually a way that you can disable the Bixby button for good on your Galaxy Note 9, and you don't even have to root your phone. I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so by default, if I press my Bixby button, Bixby is going to launch whether I do it on accident or on purpose that can be frustrating in older Galaxy devices like the S9 you could simply go into your Bixby home page you could press on the menu go to settings you would have an option here to disable your Bixby button that option does not exist on the Galaxy Note 9 there are a few ways to do this so the easiest most simple way would be just to disable it with a package disabler so you can you can grab package disabler pro for about three dollars on the play store and it's super easy to use and does not require any sort of root so we'll go ahead and open this up go down and find bixby voice you have all of these bixby apps here we're going to just disable bixby voice now when i press the bixby button nothing is going to happen at all all right so you can see that we have totally disabled the bixby button now we'll go back in there and re-enable it and then we'll see what we can do with bx actions so bx actions has just been updated to work with the galaxy note 9 and if we go ahead and enable it here select actions it says uh, double tap and long press it's not enabled uh, with bixby 2.0 and then it asks us to please unlock permissions using a pc but it works even without having to go to our pc and you can choose what you want it to do. So by default, it's going to take you to uh, the Google Assistant. So if I press the button here, it has basically been remapped to Google Assistant, which is pretty awesome. There are several other things here that you can do. If you'd rather it turn on your flashlight, it will turn on your flashlight. But if you want to open up your notification panel with the Bixby button, you can also do that. Of course, you can just totally disable the Bixby button. That way, when you press it, nothing happens. So it's disabled. If I press the Bixby button, it's going to try to launch, but it's going to kill it automatically. And essentially, you have disabled your Bixby button. And who knows how long BX Actions will work. Surely, Samsung will find a way to block that like they've been able to do with BX Actions in the past. However, that package disabler is always going to work and it doesn't require a root. So if you just want to disable the button, you're not worried about remapping it, the package disabler may be the way to go. I'll be sure to include links to both apps in the description. That about wraps it up for this video. If you liked the video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmoderx.com. Follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx. Thanks, guys, for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.